I think it's her. <laughs> Yo, what is up, guys? What is up, all you TCG fans? This is my girlfriend. This is me. I know, Loki. It's a face reveal. And I really <laughs> didn't think this through. But I got some cool stuff for us to unbox today. I'm on a vacation trip right now for me and my, my girlfriend and I anniversary, which is today. But we have a lot of downtime today since her classes are canceled. And basically everything for her is canceled. Yeah. yeah. Also, there's going to be a whole vlog thing. I'm doing a two-part vlog of San Francisco slash Berkeley. And I guess you say Oakland as well. On my uh, on a new vlogging channel, I, I'm I'm posting, so I'm gonna put the link in the description as well. But today we are here for these guys, the twelve dollar um, the uh, it's the big end collectibles, I think. I'm sorry if I forget the name. It's big collectibles. They do a lot of like loot boxes and stuff like that. So I got two, one for her, one for me. Well, they're for the channel, but she's gonna be unboxing one. I'm gonna be unboxing the other one, and we're gonna see all the cool stuff we get. And I know usually they come with Vanguard and Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh. I think those are the big three. But yeah, um, yeah, they're they're doing these for the twelve the twelve anniversary. That's why they're twelve bucks. Usually these are like twenty four bucks. And they're like, well, you said oh well, I, I don't exactly know, but yeah. So let's get into opening these. Which one did you want to open up first? Mm, this one. All right, she's gonna open up the little bit heavier one. I'm gonna open this. Is I'm gonna. The heavier one. Yeah. Oh. She's gonna open that one. I'm gonna open the other one. Um, we're gonna see what's inside of them. So I'm gonna go reset the camera so you can be facing the table, and we're gonna be unboxing them that way. So yeah, give just one second. Oh, so you open it. So there's like a little piece right here. You can just like kind of like a shoebox. No, like you just lift that up. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's it's record it's recording right now. Oh, we're recording right now. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, so this is a box. It's twelve dollars in it. Mm. It doesn't have twelve dollars in it. It was worth something. The box is twelve dollars. The content inside of it is more than twelve dollars, I believe. Mm. Ooh. Ooh. Oh wow, there's a lot. I know. So there's a first pack of Yu-Gi-Oh. I actually play Yu-Gi-Oh, so. She plays Yu-Gi-Oh, so that's gonna be cool. Yeah, Speed Duel, Starter Decks, Ultimate Predators. I don't know most of. The characters, so I can't tell you who this character is. I forgot his name too, but he's like from the original show. He's the, well, he's clearly the bug dude. He's the moth. Another Yu-Gi-Oh set. Oh, this is Weevil. This is Weevil, and that's Rex. That's right, yes. Rex, and this is Weevil. They seem pretty thick. So they say they're starter packs, so they're. There's these are speed duel speed duel starter packs. I've never played speed duel rolls, so I don't know. So this is the. And then this is Vanguard. Oh, we got some Vanguard packs. Are they the Japanese versions? Or Japanese packs? Traveling card game. Well, like I have it. no clue. Wow. Oh. I can't just want to rip it open. Oh, Another Vanguard card. Ooh. Revival collection. Revival collection. How much are these packs worth individually? Like... Depending on like how old they are, like two to four bucks. Oh, depending wow. where. Mm. Mm. They have. Don't worry, guys. We'll, we'll open up the packs in a bit. <laughs> this is my first time. Don't touch me. Oh wow, they come with sleeves. Oh, nice. And they're black. Ooh, sixty count sleeves, Legion. Are they standards? Small sleeves. So yeah, they'll fit the Vanguard ones. Suitable for you, it says. Yeah. Double well. matte finish. Ooh. That's pretty good. That's pretty cool. Okay. Um, Awakening oh. of the Asian... Force of Will. I don't play that game. I've never seen that game. I've seen it at the card car shop I visit, but... That's pretty cool. I have I didn't think they'd have Force of Will stuff. I thought it was Pokemon going and stuff. But no, mm -hmm. it's cool. Well. And... Case closed. Ooh, Buddy Fight. Vanguard also... The company that makes Vanguard, um... I'm, I'm really blanking on who makes Vanguard. Uh, Bush, Bush, Bushy Road also makes um, Buddy Fight, which is this Buddy Fight, and I guess this is the Ace Case Close Edition. Didn't know they had a Case Close Editions. I've never played Buddy Fight, so that's actually pretty cool. And that's it. That's the that's, that's literally the twelve dollar box. Do you want to open the packs? Do I want to open the packs? Okay. Do I open all of them? Yeah, open all of them and you can like show them to the camera. Oh, okay. 
Um, let's go with Price of Wealth. So we don't play this game. So. Mm. Ooh, I bet a lot of people in the comics are going to cringe over a pack opening. She's never really opened packs. I'm sorry. But it's okay. It's I first. Wanna, I don't want to ruin the cards either. Okay, going over the nice. Ooh. See, if we get any really rare cards and stuff, then please let us know. Because I, <laughs> I don't, I don't, I've never played this game. Spirit of Cloud. Prevent all damage that can be dealt. Huh. Okay. That's cool. Mm -hmm. You can say the names out too, and I'll put them to the camera. Dog Shikigami? Shikigami? Dog Shikigami. Yes. Enter. Recover two target magic stones. If yeah, I have no idea what any of this stuff means, but the cards feel really nice, though. Like the cards feel these. These are really pretty nice cards. Mana transmuter. The artwork is pretty cool. Yeah. But I feel like there's a lot going on, though. Yeah, we would have to buy like starter decks to understand what what is going on, because this, this is all of this stuff is. Ghost of Askana. Sakna, Asakna. I don't know. Puppeteer. Volley. I appreciate how many girls and women are in this card game. <laughs> because in Yu-Gi-Oh, I feel like there's not that many. And if they are, they're really weak. Contract <laughs> forced in sand. Ooh, this is a pretty good looking card. Divinity 2. Oh man, there's a lot of stuff going on. Loki's insight. You pay. I'm assuming that's water. More to play for this card. Ruin. Loki's in Divinity 2. <laughs> Spiral of chaos. Yeah, that's pretty badass. And then Ares, Knight of Emperor of the Bureau. Of this, this might be the. the the pretty rare. dope rare card that, it, yeah. that each pack usually comes with like a rare card or super it depends oh well this is pretty cool i'm assuming this means it's a super rare card but right here well where my thumb is it says sr it's usually super rare so that means this must be a rare i don't know what the u means let's see yeah okay these are probably normals these are rare this is super rare so yeah let's go back to this guy Ares Knight, God Emperor of the Burial Grounds. Or er Ares? I thought it said Ares. This is probably a light. This looks really sick. Well, in general, the back is pretty sick, too. Oh, yeah, the it's back? It's really nice. It's really nice. Like, it's not like a regular Yu Gi Oh! Like, it's plain. It actually has, like, yeah. texture to it. You should move it off. Yeah, I know. You can see it by the light. Like, yeah, that is a really nice card. I love that. Maybe, maybe I'll start collecting Force of Will cards. I don't know. If you guys want to see more, let me know. So that was the first and only first of Wills. Yeah, that we had in that pa in that box. Yeah, comment if the the women cards are actually pretty strong. I would like to. <laughs> maybe they'll make her play the game. Maybe they'll maybe make maybe we'll play the game and I'll record them on my phone and then I'll upload to the channel. Let me let me know, guys, or let us know. Strong women characters. Yes. Strong women characters. Yeah. <laughs> All Alright, wait, wait, what pack are you opening? The, we which? are opening the Revival Collection. The Revival Collection of Vanguard. Alright, let's see what we got in here. Okay. Oh, I've never seen Vanguard cards. They're pretty cool. I, li I like Vanguard. Oh, there's only three. Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. So the first one, I don't know the name. New Faith Mutant Little Dorcas. Wow, this is like a pretty dope looking one. It's a rare one. But it's got like a full, because usually there's like little like background thing right here. That's a pretty cool one. It's a mega colony insect. Huh. It's a grade one. Oh, you're playing. Oh, this is, this is, that's actually a really cool card. I, I've never played mega colony before. I'm usually a Kagero. Cosmic Hero Grand Rope. Oh, this is a battle roid? Yeah, dimensional, dimension police. Oh, these are, these are pretty sick cards. Ooh, it's another great one. Son of Eternity, Amaterasu? No way. 
No way, you got an Amaterusu? This is a double rare. Yeah, this is pretty cool. Like, I heard, like, some of the Amaterus are actually pretty good cards. I think I have a couple back in my old collection. It's a G Guardian, too. Oh, grade 4. I don't really play the grade 4 stands anymore as much, because, I don't know. Like, I just didn't feel like reconstructing a deck to make grade 4s. This is pretty cool. Oh, okay. Now we're going to do the Vanguard one. An another Vanguard, which has Ren on the front cover. Mm, Vanguard. Don't judge me for how I open these. I'm still rather a new TCG person. Oh, wow. Fierce Leader Zachary. Sick, sick, sick. Oh, maybe you only got three because the ones that you got were like super rare. Yeah, they're probably like just a rare. You get generally rare packs. Iron Fist Maiden, Roly Poly. I actually love Roly Polies. <laughs> you like this guy then? Mm, that one looks menacing. Roly Polies are supposed to be nice. Eagle Knight of the Skies. A Royal Paladin. That looks pretty good. Blue Scale Deer. Oh, yeah. Oracle Think Tank. Oh, this one's really cool. Oh, it's Black hot. Dragon Well, Mortimer. Ooh, a gold paladin. Ooh, look at that. It's another rare. Oh, I, I like how the, holo, the hologram, the hollow, yeah. the hollow foil. That's pretty cool. And this is case closed. Alright, now this is from the Buddy Fight. I've never played Buddy Fight. I think I already said that, so. I don't, again, I don't know if his cards are going to be good or not. Serial murder case. I think this is the. I said event. Serial is it a game in one? Yeah, like, wait, like it's a card game. Like. It's well. I know Case Closed is an anime, different from Buddy Fight. So I'm assuming this is like a, like a special pack release. I don't know. Like again, I don't know how rare these are. Ooh, I like the backs. The backs are pretty cool. Yeah, they feel really nice. I can feel some texture. Character one. Investigation Division 1, Miwako Sato. Huh. The characters look a lot like an anime. Witch of a Thousand Face. Yeah. Well, Case Closed is an anime. Oh, it is an anime? Yeah. Because there's Case Closed, which is an anime, and then Buddy Fight, which is a card game and an anime. Oh. So I'm assuming they did, like, a collaboration. So. Mm -hmm. But I don't know. Like, I don't really know much about this. Uh, Witch of a Thousand Faces, Vermouth. Public Security Bureau raid. Inventor. Oh, he's got a little hollow to him. Oh, I think they all do. Nah, these ones didn't, but these guys did. Mm. And if I did, if I did miss one, then sorry about that. Private Eye. Oh. Yeah, these two are rares. And then seeking the truth. Oh, oh, that's a triple rare. Yo, those are pretty rare. <laughs> like that's a pretty rare. And this is also the main character, Conan Edogawa. Edogawa. Sorry, I can't really speak Japanese, guys. I'm Hispanic. An American Hispanic. That's pretty cool. Dang, got like one pretty triple rare card. I don't know actually how rare compared to is to like a lot of these, but that's really nice. Sick. All right, we're going to clean this up a little bit. Those are just There's 60 just... Sleeves. sleeves. So, yeah, we're going to clean this up a bit, and we're going to get to the second one. Do I open these? Oh, that's right. I forgot about those. Yeah, if you want, you can open them. Okay, we'll just take a glass at them. Here, I'll help you open this one. Okay, now you can buy these ones that, like, Target and stuff. These speed duels. 
Okay, this is this. There's also a dual links thing here. Oh, look, you get red eyes. Hmm, I mean, this one looks really nice. Let's see the finish. <laughs> okay. Do you want to show them to the camera? Oh. <laughs> yes. Jar of Avarice. Hypermetamorphous, hidden parasite, Ptinoth, big insect, basic insect, <laughs> wing cleaver. Oh, they're all insects. Okay, his is, is an insect deck. Mm, insect Cocoon deck. of evolution, man eater bug. Loki, I hate bugs. This is a perfect deck for her. No, it's not. It's terrible. I actually have this one. Oh yeah, I have a few of those as well. Can I... That spider egg? Why? There's enough spiders that we don't need more spider cards. <laughs> no. <laughs> the Weevil. This is the Rex one. So we got Order to Charge. Dinosaur Kingdom. I don't know what these are. What is it? It's Field Spell Rex. I don't know what kind of... I don't know speed rules, so I don't know what the difference between these blue cards. A Nightmare Sonic Blast. Serpent Knight Dragon. It's pretty cool. Two-Headed King Rex. Urabi. Two Urabis. Crawling Dragon number two. Tumazaros. Anthrosaurus. Black Tyranno. Super Ancient Dino Beast. Mad Sword Beast, Gilosaurus, Gale Lizard, Dark Triceratops, Hyper Hammerhead, Elementsaurus, Black Stego, Gentlemander, interesting, Raised Body Heat, Ultra Evolution Pill, Space Time Transcendence, Cost Down, Cost Down's a pretty good card to have, Summer's Art, White Elephant's Gift, Heat Wave, Guard Advance, two Guard Advance, Hunting Instinct, Reinforcements, Infantry Cool, Pharaoh's Treasure, and Limit Impulse. So there you go, guys. There's one pack, and now we're going to get to the second pack. Let's be right back. Take two, because I guess my phone wasn't recording the other part, because I ran out of space on my phone, because I didn't free it up. But it's okay. Or you can pretend that I didn't see anything and that it's fine whatsoever. This is the second box the container. Oh my god. So we got a microphone of it. And before um, we recorded even the first attempt at making this part, um, we were saying that we didn't get a minifigure. And we got a little, mi a little figure. I have no idea where it's from, who it is, what it is. I think it's a dragon. I assume it's a dragon. But yeah, let me know what this is, guys. I have no idea what this is from or where it's from. Like, I don't know where it is. Like, I, I don't know. But it looks cool. So I don't even know where I'm going to be. Like, I don't even know what it's for. Like, is it a magnet? It looks like you can stick it to the wall or something. Alright, we're going to have to test that in a bit. So, actually, do we have anything metal? Metal? No, I that don't. chair, right? Um, no, it's not. Sad. And then also, okay. So... We also got one of these. It's a little structure uh, deck for Wise Shars? Shores? I've never played this game. I never thought I'd ever own a card from this game before. Because from what my friend has described to me, it's basically like a Loli game. And you know what I was telling my girlfriend? Because she asked, oh, what is Loli? And then that's when I realized that the phone was all cut off. Or no, she told me about the phone being cut off. It's like, for most people, it's like... Like, it's, like, all anime character girls, so that's all I've ever seen. I think there's a couple of guys, like, you know, Kirito and uh, Ed, Edward, or Ed from Full Metal. Um, those are just from the top of my head. I'm pretty sure there's a lot more characters. So there's this. I never thought, like, I'd own it. But now that I have the pack, I guess I'll, like, you know, show you what I got. Like, I don't know if it's, like, yeah, I, can't, I actually can't open this because I don't know where the little thing is. I don't want to ruin the cards. Like, <sighs> I 
<sighs> so we're almost there. Oh my god. Finally, I'm going to throw this trash later. Just going to put it off to the side. All right, so we got this chick. Her name is Wonderful Magic Mioi. Start with 14 members. Rika. Veteran Trainer. I don't know how to play this game. I don't know what it's about. I don't. I just know it's a bunch of anime girls. Oh, then a dude. In Lesson Kirati. Taking a step once more. Producer. Fuck. And again, I don't know if these cards are rare at all. Like, I don't know anything about this game. Just, I just don't. I've seen it before. I just never. In, wait, did I even say this one? Start with number 14, Media. In addition, Mio. First job, Media. My first star. Oh my god, there's a lot of this chick. Charisma, JK, Mika. First job, Rika. How do you, would you even play this game? Like, there's numbers and stuff. I don't, like... Like, is this, like... A, a, what, what the hell? This one's signed. My first step, me... Whoa, what the hell? Is this super rare? Because I know when people sign this, like, when, when cards come like this, it means they're, like... Like, dope rare. Like, I have a few couple of Vanguard cards that are, like, $90. Is this, like, the equivalent? Like, is this worth, like, cash monies? My first step, me... Like, Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. I What the fuck? If that's true, then, oh my god. Together with Anzu Kirari. 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 <laughs> Alright, I got different versions of them. First job, Kirari. Oh, it's her, except unholified. Super happy, happy candy shower. Oh, these ones are, like, sideways, so, okay. I guess there's multiple cards. Please, Cinderella. Please Cinderella, please Cinderella, please Cinderella. Highest stage. Alright, and that is it for this pre-booster deck pack. Don't know what any means. I guess you have four of each card. Where is it, where is it, where is it, where is it, where is it? There we got this super rare card, like. I can look it up. You can look it up, okay. Alright, there you go. She's gonna look it up and then by the end of the video, I'll See if it has any value to it. But that's pretty cool. Even if it's not, that's pretty cool to have. Like, a, a signed card. Alright, we got another bag in here. Just a plastic. Is this for this? Like, do I put this in here? Uh. Oh, this is the stand. Oh, it's a stand for him. Okay, that's sick. Okay, so, you know, it's not a magnet. We got a bunch of things over there. We got a Yu-Gi-Oh! Hidden Summoner, Hidden Summoner's Pack. Yu-Gi-Oh! Code of the Duelist. Uh, Unite Team 4 Q4 Special Pack. Ooh, I haven't seen one of these in forever. Knight of Silence, Galatine. Gravity Bolt Dragon. And then, ooh, a Special Vanguard Pack. Alright, we're going to open the, the uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Packs first. We're going to go with the Hidden Summoner's one. Actually, is there a... No, there's not a little thing. There's no, apparently. <sighs> Defender of Nephthys. Oh, wait, here. Where's the camera? Here's the camera. Defender of Nephthys. Last Hope of Nephthys. Prank Kids Weather Washer. Shiranu's Spectral Sword. And uh, Shafu the Wield Miyakashi. Sick. I don't know how actually good or rare these cards are, but these are pretty cool. Set those right here. Get the trash out of the way. Alright. Uh, Code of the Duelist. I don't really keep up with a lot of the Yu-Gi-Oh cards that often. Like, we play Yu-Gi-Oh. Like, when I play Yu-Gi-Oh, like, kind of, like, every so often. But we don't, like, super collect, collect cards. Dark World Brainwashing. F.A. Sonic Meister. Zabina. World Legacy Landmark, Salvagent Driver, that's a pretty cool design. Uh, Raven Dread Slayer, Twilight Twin Dragon, Gravity Lash, and FA Downforce. 
Okay, this is a pretty cool. This is a pretty cool. And then I'll I guess I'll keep these guys in the pack. Cause, like I don't think there's yeah these are just single pack like like Knight of Science skeleton. Oh, is it Knight of Kami? Gravity Bolt Dragon. Duh, Gravity Bolt. That would have duh. It's not a Kami. So, yeah, this is that. I'm not gonna take them out of the packs. Like I'm just gonna leave them as it is. Like I have these cards. I just these guys are these way. So. We'll set them here. Um, you know, we'll do the special Q4 one because I've gotten I've gotten these before. Pre YouTube TCG stuff. All right, I got a Grape Shot Wyvern. That's pretty cool. One place for one inch regardless of turn. He has three thousand at the end of the turn, and another uh, imaginary Force Kai card, which is pretty cool. I guess I got him to the deck. Like it doesn't hurt to have these guys. So sick. They're better than just the regular ones too. So. Sick. Put that there. And then the last pack. I feel like I feel like uh my girlfriend got more stuff, more packs and stuff to unlock. Cause all these are pretty. Yeah, or I think you got a figurine. Yeah, I think the figurine probably. So this card is worth twenty-seven dollars. Ooh, twenty-seven dollars. That's what I'm talking about. And this card is a Flying Liberian. Dark Regular. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. So yeah, that was a faster unboxing because I think there was just less stuff because I got that. But, and she had more packs and everything to open up. Uh, there we go. So yeah. Pretty cool. So yeah, there we go. We have that. That is the rest of these two unboxings. If you guys want to see more of these, let me know. And I will order these, like, probably another two boxes next time again. Um, I don't know if my girlfriend will be into that next time. It depends if she's down or I'm up. San Francisco really does depend. But we can figure something out. So yes. Thanks, guys.